Good morning, wizards, muggles, and everyone. We're here at Watford Junction, and we're waiting for our bus to head over to the Warner Brothers Harry Potter studio tour in London. We're on the double-decker Harry Potter bus on the way to the studio tour. It's the Harry Potter bus. Not the night bus, though. It's not the night bus. It's the day bus. Yeah. We made it into the building, and now we have to wait in this massive line to get through the entrance. But uh, it's only because it's actually sold out today. We're coming here two days before New Year's, so it's a little craziness. We are about to go into the tour and we're passing the cover under the stairs. Welcome to We are inside the Great Hall. So you wait in line, then you get into this room where they give you some information, and then they bring you into the great hall over here. And you have a very limited amount of time because they clear out the room for the next tours. And then out here, it's all self-guided. And there are a bunch of props and costumes and everything out here. So over here, we have some set pieces and costumes from the Yule Ball. All this stuff looks awesome. I wish I could drink this champagne that's over here. Look at this ice cream. Oh, that looks good. There's cool stuff all around me and even above me. I'm a little overwhelmed with where to look. There's some wigs behind me. They're all labeled with the characters on there. There's Dumbledore, McGonagall. Oh, Luna Lovegood, I like her hair. highlight in this room. So we have the Hogwarts gates. We have the leaky cauldron and there's some really fun fake fire down there. There's a crack in the cauldron. Behind me is the Goblet of Fire. Over here we have the boys' dormitory. We're approaching the Gryffindor common room. So if you're with kids, you get these little passports and you go around and you stamp them at all the spots. Oh, they collect them? Yeah. We found the wands. These are the actual wands they used in the movie. This is the entrance to Dumbledore's office in the movies. You can actually go into his office. These are the real sets that were used in the making of the Harry Potter films. Behind me, we have some various props that were used in the different movies. We've got the prison number from the Prisoner of Azkaban. 
Rita Skeeter's notebook, the Philosopher's Stone. I thought they destroyed this thing. The actual Goblet of Fire. I never realized it was made of wood. Ooh, Defense Against the Dark Arts. Okay, we're in the potions classroom and this is pretty much the biggest set we've seen so far, besides the Great Hall, of course. snow and fire. They made tons of fake snow for these movies, so you can check out the different types of snow that they used over at the stand here. So this is shredded paper, this is shredded plastic. This feels kind of like sand. Ooh, this is way different. This is the neatest one. standing in front of Hagrid's hut, which is right across from where the fake snow was and right next to the potions area. The burrow! The Chamber of Secret store is right behind me. It's massive. And then we have the Gringotts door over here, which is really cool. I remember in the movie all these locks move around. There's so much more stuff to see here. They recommend three hours. We've already been here for two and we're not even in the outdoor area yet. I know we're slow, but it's still a lot. actually ride on a broom they'll put you in front of a green screen and then they'll give you a little video of yourself flying but it's 40 pounds for a video and the photo which is about $60 we're not gonna do that so you can see behind me that this just keeps going and going So the Death Eaters are up to no good over there. I'm gonna keep walking right past that. These are the fireplaces from the Ministry of Magic. This is how they get around. Whoa. Oh, the prophecy orbs. Umbridge, we better get out of here quick. I think that's gonna wrap it up for stage one, so we're gonna head out and see what else is here. Overwhelmed, really, there's so much.